Hey everyone, it's Connor. Happy Sunday. I hope you are having a fabulous day so far and having a good wrap up to your weekend. Make sure to enjoy it. Now, you usually don't see me here on Sundays. Normally, I'm just Monday through Saturday for my videos, but I wanted to get this review out as just a bonus review for Sunday. And so I was like, why not treat my viewers with a Sunday candle review? So I am burning morning cartoons from Kringle Candle. Now this one is long overdue for review. I have been going through all the fall Kringles and I did this like last month in like late August and September. Um, I went through the country and Kringle new fall candles and this was the one that I just hadn't gotten to review So now I can finally say I am done now um, Last but not least morning cartoons. This one is really really good. That's why <laughs> That's why it's going at the end because I love it that much Last is the best, but yeah, I really really like this candle. We're gonna get into the scent We're gonna get into the performance and everything else um, this is kind of, you guys probably haven't seen this area for a candle review. My dad just recently built me this table and I'm going to do a 0.5 so you can see. That is my, um, tripod if you're wondering what the black thing is. But yeah, my dad actually built this whole like shelf for me. It's just a little, a little skinny shelf and I have some candles on there. <clears throat> I have a berry pumpkin waffles. This is where I'm going to burn once I'm done with this one. But yeah, so thank you, my Thank you to my dad for building this for me. But yeah, that is what I'm burning right here. It is in my bedroom. And like I said, I'm really, really enjoying this candle. I am going to link it down below. Um, I am a Kringle Candle Ambassador, so you can use my code Connor Loves Candles to get 15% off. But if you want an even better deal, as me speaking right now, these are actually on sale for $17.50 for the large jars and then $13.59 for the medium jars. Um, the Kringle Candle Company is doing an anniversary sale where it is $12 off of um, select jars and this is one of the select. So you can get that on sale. Unfortunately, with the anniversary sale, you cannot use my code. But if you're buying this and there's no sale going on, always use Connor Love Candles to, Connor Loves Candles, sorry. Connor Loves Candles to get 15% off of your order. But yeah, let's go ahead and get right into the notes on this one. So the top notes are brown sugar, toasted waffles, and cinnamon. The mid notes are pumpkin spice, maple syrup, and creamy butter. And then the base notes are warm woods accord, amber, and vanilla accord. So that is kind of like a big varying notes. But um, this one to me is kind of like the crinkle candle version of pumpkin pecan waffles from Bath & Body Works. I definitely pick up that waffle vibe. Um, so in here it says toasted waffles. You pick up a little bit of spice on those waffles with the cinnamon and it's really only cinnamon, but it's a very light cinnamon. And then you get the sweetness from that brown sugar, the vanilla, the amber, you get maple syrup on those waffles. You get the butter, pumpkin spice, Again, brown sugar, just really, really nice. So this is kind of like the Crayola Candle version of pumpkin pecan waffles. I really, really like this one and it is fantastic. I will say the throw is a little bit lower than I'm wanting, but I can withstand this one being a little bit lighter, but this is definitely a favorite for me in the new Kringle Fall line for this year. It is so delicious. Now, one thing I do wanna point out is I'm kind of confused why Kringle Candle used this picture for the label. It is a bowl of Fruit Loops. So I, when I first bought this one, I was nervous because I was like, this is gonna smell like a fruity cereal and I don't know if I'm gonna like it. But then I was shocked when I smelt it. It does not smell like Fruit Loops or like a rainbow cereal. It really smells like a pumpkin pecan waffles. Like that is what it smells like. I do think that there is a little bit of fruitiness in this one. Um, just a hint of fruitiness, which also, which leads me to my next point. This kind of reminds me 
a tad of berry pumpkin waffles from Homeworks, as you can see right here. This one is blueberry pumpkin, cinnamon, clove, nutmeg, and vanilla bean. They both have that waffle um, note that they share. The berry pumpkin waffles is heavier on the fruit though. And I think that this one, the morning cartoons, that one is heavier on like the maple syrup. Though they both are similar in a way. The description on Kringle says, inspired by our inner child, morning cartoons will transform you back to the early morning, slurping up the fruity milk left at the bottom of your cereal bowl. I think that that is so odd that they use that description because in my opinion, that's not really what I pick up. I don't get like that fruity milk scent. I pick up, again, pumpkin pecan waffles. That is what I get. I get like a maple syrup um toasted waffle delicious like in the morning kind of nostalgic that's what i pick up i don't pick up that much fruitiness i mean when i smell it on cold i do get a little bit of fruitiness and like a bit of milkiness but i don't really pick up like the description that it's giving and it doesn't even have a fruit note in the notes Again, it's got brown sugar, waffles, cinnamon, pumpkin spice, maple syrup, creamy butter, warm ones accord, and amber vanilla cord. There's no fruity note in here. There's no cereal note in here. There is no uh, milk note in here. It's really just like a pumpkin waffle scent. Let me look up the notes for pumpkin pecan waffles. Sorry, I know I'm getting sidetracked, but pumpkin pecan waffles, Bath and Buddy Works. Because I want to compare the two in the notes because I really get pumpkin pecan waffles. So Bath and Body Works says it smells like a sweet, nutty autumn wake up call you crave. And then the notes are maple syrup, golden waffles, pumpkin spice, and brown sugar. There is a waffle note in the Kringle one. There's a maple note in the Kringle one. And there is a pumpkin spice and a brown sugar. I really do believe that this is Kringle's version of pumpkin pecan waffles. So... I again, I really, really in like this sin. I would definitely pick up more of it. Let's get into the performance. So like I said, the throw is a little bit low for me. Um, I'm going to give this one like a four or a five, which I would love to see this one come back next year with a stronger throw. Because again, it's a really, really nice scent. If you like gourmand candles or like pumpkin, pecan, waffles, or just like a waffle maple syrup candle. This one is really, really nice. And I'm one of those people that loves that. And so I just wish that I had a little bit more strength and throw. But other than that, the burn has been doing really well. As you can see how clean the burn is. I mean, there's no soot. Really clean burn. The wax is staying the same color. The wicks are doing really well. They're not too big or anything. I mean, you don't even have to cut these wicks, honestly. You can just leave them how they are. And that's one of the good things about the Kringle soy candles. But yeah, this is such a clean burn. So my only complaint with this one is the strength and throw. So hopefully um, Kringle and Mick Kittredge can improve the throw and bring this one back here. Because I definitely think that this is one of my favorites um, from the fall so far and from that line. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. Comment down below if you have this candle and let me know what your thoughts are on it. Um, and thanks for joining me here on Sunday. I know that's not normal, but um, it's normal for today. Um, I am going to be linking down the candle below. Again, use Connor Loves Candles to get 15% off your order. That will not work with the current anniversary sale that's going on right now. <clears throat> because that's such a good deal. And I did pick up like 12 candles on that sale. So definitely go stock up, but I would suggest picking this one up. At least pick it up in the daylight. Um, let me make sure, yeah, it is in the daylight and then it's also in the wax melt. So you got a three wick, large jar, which is this one. Then you have the medium, the daylight and the wax melt. So yeah, I'll link down below the large jar and then you can find <clears throat> on the Kringle website, the other formats. but. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe to help support my channel and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.